folks, welcome back here to the Vegas Downtown. We're here off of Horizon Ridge Parkway, westbound in the city of Henderson, now crossing Amador Lane. And I saw something interesting back there. I'm trying to get up on this hill to see what these homes look like. There's a cement mixer back up there, but I, you know, the problem is these are all construction zones, and uh, so they're all gonna, they all have no trespassing signs out there. So you have to wait until they're built before you can go out there and really explore them. Unfortunately, now coming up to light at Valle Verde, which is a north-south artery here, pretty major north-south artery here in Las Vegas, or in Henderson east of Las Vegas. McDonald Ranch here on the left. That's a very exclusive, very expensive place to live. Here in Henderson, we're gonna wait our turn. We've got the green light here at Five Verde, so continuing westbound on Horizon Ridge Parkway here in Henderson. Temperature outside, car reads 118 degrees Fahrenheit. Two seasons here in Las Vegas, you get summer and winter and that's it there is really no fall and no spring simply vegas real estate it says there on the right there as we come up here to roma hills drive sun city mcdonald ranch a del webb community we are crossing through now it brings us up here to high mesa crazy out in Summerlin. They're building out like crazy in the northwestern part of town. They're building like crazy down here in Henderson. But there's no water. I really think they do that because they, they tell people that there's no water because they're, they don't care that there's no water. They're just going to sell it to the people in California. This is my humble opinion. They're going to sell it to the people in California for more money than they could sell it for a year because people in California, of course, make more money than we do here in Vegas. And that's what they really want to do. They want to save the water to sell it to California. Carmel Valley Street. In the meantime, they're really pushing everyone to get rid of their grass lawns and zero escape and I mean, it's really a very hardcore push right now. Mountain Dell Avenue, that was called there. Farmer in the Dell. There is no Picos because Picos becomes St. Rose. But this is Green Valley Parkway, which is another major north-south artery here in the city of Henderson. Target right there on the left. Along with a whole bunch of shopping in this area, this intersection. Finally got the green light here at Green Valley Parkway. That was a long one. Now continuing westbound on Horizon Ridge Parkway. Past that aforementioned Target, Walgreens. AAA Auto Repair Center over here on our right. And an AutoZone Auto Parks store. back into the residential areas. Maybe it's just me, but it seems so bright today. I don't know why. Very, very bright out. Crossing Annette Street, you have St. Rose Pediatrics here on the right, along with Campiero Plastic Surgery, Carter, uh, Cataract Doctor, Cassidy Law Offices, Neurology Center. And this is going to bring us here to Carnegie. Which I will make a left at because I'd like to show you something here. And we will wait our 
turn here at this light at Carnegie Street. We've got the green light here at Carnegie Street. I want to point out this one restaurant right here on our right. Lindo, Lindo Majokin La Loma. 37 lunch specials here. Very good food in here. I've been here a few times. No one pays me to say these things, so this is all just my humble opinion. Very, very good food. It's not very busy right now. The weekends it gets packed in here. But they have a seating area at the back of the restaurant with these huge windows. And this is your view. You get to sit here and eat your Mexican food, your dinner, lunch, dinner, whatever, they open for lunch too, obviously. And there is your view. You have the entire Las Vegas Strip out there. It's just magnificent. I highly recommend this place, not just for the food, but also the view. If you're into views, some people are. I kind of am, so. That is just a, it's a very, very cool place to sit there and have a beer and, or whatever your preferred adult beverage is and have a nice big burrito and just hang out and check out the view of the strip. Really cool stuff, in my humble opinion. It's gonna bring us back out here to Carnegie and make a right onto Carnegie. Continue southbound. Mission Ridge condominiums over here on our left. Still reading 118 degree temperature out there, according to the car. This is Carnegie Heights. Over here on our right, that's a gated community, can't show you that. I'd love to be able to show you more of these neighborhoods, but I can't, it's, it, it, they're all gated. Oh, maybe this is an accident. Sitting here, looks like they're on the phones waiting for police. Another gated community here on our right. These houses here on our left are pretty big. Look at that. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Those are condos. Okay. My bad. Those are condos. southern terminus of Carnegie here at Green Valley Parkway. So we essentially went back east and met up here with Green Valley Parkway to the left or Sunridge Heights Parkway to our right. We're going to make a right on the Sunridge Heights Parkway as soon as we uh, the cross traffic clears. homes right here. Really cool stuff. If you can afford it, something called canyons in there. Really cool views up there. And again, these balconies pretty much face north here, so you're going to be somewhat spared from the western sun in the afternoons especially the summer afternoons. Winter afternoons doesn't matter. I mean, it still gets bright in your face, but at least it's not 120 degrees. And that haze, looks like it's thickening out there. Really bad. Sandy Ridge Avenue that we're crossing now. M50 there on our left. That's a, a high-end uh, X5. M50i. So it's going to have the... Uh, 
uh, faster engine in it. And that's going to bring us up here to Eastern Avenue, where we will make a right and go northbound. Three ninety nine a gallon, regular gasoline cash price there at that Shell. Don't forget the nine tons of a cent. Least discount, discount list, ugh, least discount liquors there, right in front of us. Sunridge at McDonald Ranch. Um, there. Eastern Hills Center on our left. Silva Learning Center. Bell's Barbecue. Eggworks. All sorts of shopping options here along Eastern. In fact, in my humble opinion, there might actually be too many simply because the traffic gets so bad in here. It, and the weekends, forget it. It's like impossible to move in here. Winchell's Pub and Grill, Grill I believe that's on chain here in town as well. Chevron gas station there. Gas is 30 cents cheaper with car wash. $3.69 a gallon. We're going to wait our turn here at Horizon Ridge Parkway. Continuing east. I'm sorry, northbound on the eastern. Got the green light here at Horizon Ridge Parkway. All sorts of dining options in this area, too. If you ever find yourself down here in Henderson off of Eastern Avenue, you've got a million and one dining options in here. Everything from chilies to uh, all sorts of... There's uh, Twin Peaks. There's um, Shakespeare's... Well, no, I think they closed that, actually. Scratch that one. This is Coronado Center. Here, Arby's over there on the left, Applebee's, of course, and uh, Five Guys, that's a burger place for international viewers that might not be aware. Arby's is a sandwich joint, I'm not sure how widespread they are over, overseas. The Applebee's Neighborhood Grill and Bar sit-down restaurant, as we cross over Coronado Center. Buffalo Wild Wings there on the left. There used to be a Nacho Daddy in here too, which is a really cool nacho place, sit-down restaurant, but they ended up closing this location down here in Henderson. There's still two others, two other locations. Or maybe there's three. There's one out on West Charleston, I think it is, and then there's one downtown at Fremont Street. This is bringing us up, bringing us up to the light here at St. Rose Parkway, which is a major north-south artery here. It's also, it also runs east-west, or technically runs northeast-southwest here in the city of Henderson. Um, and it is very congested. Especially when you get into the rush hour hours. Because there is no single rush hour. It's always rush hours. It's going to bring us up here to the light at Ioni. I-O-N-E. We're going to make a left onto Ioni Road. Let's wait for these people to make U-turns. Cucina Italiana. I see in the shopping center there, next to a Panera Bread. Fine Wine Spirits Craft Beer. We will go straight. Furniture over here on our left. Clever name. This is a Target shopping center in here, on the, located on the corner of Silverado Ranch Boulevard, and oh, and the stop sign. Whoops. Uh, Silverado Ranch Boulevard and Eastern Avenue. There's also an Office Depot in here. Michaels, PetSmart, Dollar Tree. There used to be a Kirkland's in here. I'm gonna go ahead and get over here. Scrubs and Beyond. This is a bakery here, it looks like. We're going to go ahead and uh, there's a Freddy's Steak Burgers over there across us, in front of us. 
for joining. We really appreciate each and every single one of you. And if you haven't already, please do like, follow, and subscribe to us on YouTube and TikTok. We really appreciate it. It helps the algorithm. And so your voice carries more weight when you like, follow, subscribe, and share. Um, because then it thinks that uh, this is a good video, which hopefully you think that this is a good video. So, uh, Also, check out our gear available on the merchandise or the uh, shop section of YouTube. Uh, Vegas Don logo shirts on top of the Las Vegas Strip skyline. Uh, Christmas is coming up. Maybe find something for yourself, your significant other. And uh, as always, remember here on the Vegas Don channel, it's the journey. We'll see you next time, folks.